Hey everybody, TapTap Tap here. So, we're probably just about to the end of the- Oh hey, the thing finally popped up. We're just about to the end of the pirate event. And, um, it seems we're only given heads up for when events end, uh, about a week until before they end, which is frustrating and annoying, and I've never seen another mobile game do that, like that, except for Abyssrium, which is the case in many other weird things this game does. But, uh, it seems they've settled into a regular pattern finally, so it really seems like events always start at the very beginning of the month, first week. You know, they still do their stupid slow rollouts, so hard to tell exactly when, but first week, usually, and your event is gonna end, you know, just before the next one begins. So, pretty much the full length of the month. And they, they even seem to name events by month now. So, that should be a teller. Um, they have confirmed before that the July event is going to be the anniversary one, so expect the anniversary event in July, in about a week. Um, so, a few little concerns here. Um, one of the most common things, and this is why every time I do a Hidden Fish video for an event, the first thing I do is tell you, go buy these event items at the bottom here, and wear them throughout the whole event, because if you don't, you don't get all the Hidden Fish, because they're required. Um, always, they're always the one at the bottom. This one was a little bit confusing because there's two pirate ones actually. There's this Atlantic pirate thing. This does not count for the event because uh, it has to be the event run. So it's way here at the bottom. So, and they're always, the new ones are always at the bottom. So just always wear the three at the bottom and they'll cost event currency instead of other stuff. Um, see, so that's biggest reason anyone misses event fish. It's always that. So always wear all three, because sometimes they don't say that they require things, but they do. And because I, you know, I wear all three of the things, I don't necessarily know that they're required. Just wear them to stop grief. Um, another odd thing with this event, um, a lot of people ask if they're going to keep the Kraken, or they're like, oh, why should I pay 100,000 candies for the Kraken? Because the visiting Kraken never goes away. Uh, the thing is, it's not going to stay forever. It's, you know, it's a bug that the visiting Kraken happens. Um, so, like, you'll see people with two Krakens, or, like, people will... They'll get the visiting Kraken you're supposed to take a picture of, and after they take the picture, it never goes away. Um, I'm, like, 99% sure the moment the next event rolls around, that Kraken's not going to pop up anymore. So, if you want to buy... If you want to have the Kraken and keep it, you really should buy the dang thing. Um, it's, you know... This game is buggy, so expect anything odd behavior, just expect is a bug and not intended. Um, speaking of the Kraken, there's still about a week, you know, almost exactly a week as of recording this video, uh, to do the event. That is kind of just enough time, especially, excuse me, if you already have it mostly done. Uh, if you don't have the Kraken yet, you know, you get about, what was it, about 20,000. Every time you cast level 10 crap, you get about 20,000. So that's five days of the crab. Um, if you're starting completely from scratch, you could prob you can still do it. You'd have to play pretty intently, and you'd have to... Um, the real equalizer here is that when you upgrade the crab now, the ads get upgraded too. So even if you only had, say, a couple of days to buy the Kraken from zero, but you had everything else, if you watched a crap ton of ads, as unpleasant as it is, uh, you would eventually be able to do it. So you can do it. I believe in you. Um... And otherwise, as always, the, the candy does continue to the next event, which is why I've hoarded this up. I, I already know I will get asked why I have 400,000 candy next event. Um, so feel free to hoard that candy for the next event to make it a little bit easier on you. One of the common concerns of the last anniversary event was it was very expensive. I assume it will not be quite that bad, relatively speaking, this time, but I don't know. And we, as always, I have no insider information. They don't... <laughs> They, they don't even respond to my support requests. The new guy does. The new They have a new social media intern that, like, actually cares about their job, which is nice, but I don't tend to talk to them much anyway. They don't, like, give me extra info. They do send random people, like, random people ask, like, oh, when the next, when's the next event? And then they'll give them a hint, and so usually that, that'll be end up posted on Reddit, but... <laughs> so random people get insider information, but not me, but whatever. Um... What else is there? Oh yeah, there is a little exploit with the, the, the Hermit Crab, which is extremely inconsistent. Let me see if I can get it to trigger. Basically what happens is that there's a lot of other things that make it happen, but 
Basically, once you've cast the Hermit Crab a few times or even completely exhausted it, you close the app, open it again, and it'll be completely refreshed. The thing is, this is super inconsistent, and it's inconsistent in a not... It's like doubly inconsistent because when it works, it'll happen every time for a brief, for like a while. Every time you try to do it, it'll do it. So like if you get it, you can exploit it to your heart's content. Um, yeah, see, it, I don't think it worked this time. Oh wait, it did. Huh. That's interesting. So yeah, it, do, it does work. And so if I did this repeatedly, like right now, it would keep working. Um, but the thing is, I could log in here like f in five hours and it could not work at all. I actually made a video for this as of the Egypt event and I tried to show it off and it didn't work. And I told a bunch of other people how to do it and it didn't work. So I canned the video. I don't even, I think I just straight up deleted it. Um, <laughs> Cause it just didn't seem consistent and it's entirely possible it will or won't work for you and if it doesn't work don't even worry about it it's just you know you can try again like the next day or something we really have no idea why it works or why it doesn't um some people have other like rituals they do like they change the die um and stuff i would say just close the the app always works when it works it just doesn't always work um there there's no rhyme or reason to why it works um it's worked on Nox app player and my phone. I don't know if it, it's worked on I, iOS. It probably has. Somebody would have mentioned if it worked on everything but that by now, probably. It's just really inconsistent. Um, so I, I wouldn't really worry about it. It's not so consistent that you can really get it to work. I wouldn't depend on it. And obviously, if you think it's cheating, well, don't do it. You, you don't need to do it. Um, and as with the Hermit Crab, it seems like... We keep getting the Hermit Crab every event, and it seems like events are going to be every month. So, like, it seems like the game is going to be in a perpetual state of events, more or less. So, I guess that's why there's no, like, expand item for the Hermit Crab. You can just keep him all the time, just because... It feels like we're going to be a constant loop of events, which I support, except... They got into this pattern where they would do either an event or an update for, like, regular content every month. If we're going to have events every month... I think we should have regular content updates too. Maybe not monthly, of course, but like we're never going to get the krill farm at this rate. There's like, there's only like maybe three or four months left that do not have events. I actually think it's less than four months now. Um, I think there's like January and maybe April that don't have events. There's, there's almost no months remaining that don't have an event already. Oh, and a lot of people ask if this event is going to repeat. We don't really know if this specific June event is going to repeat, but every event has repeated in some manner or another. So it might be, like, the, the um, what's... It might be the ninja event next year, but you can go back and buy the pirate fish in a different tab. Because um, this was something that the spring event had last time. There was two tabs over here. There was the new fish and the old fish. I just assume that it may not be the same theme, but next June event, there's going to be a tab where you can buy the old June event fish. So, yeah. Oh, also, uh, a lot of people had trouble with the, the stupid um, treasure map quest thing. I mean, it's not stupid, it's just completely loaded with bugs. Um, if the things didn't work, just keep doing them, basically. Uh, read the written guide. I always, I don't like the video guides. They're... <laughs> It's impossible to make a video as concise as a written thing, unless it's, you know, like, really requires a visual component, which this game really doesn't. Um, so I always recommend my own visual guides over my own videos. I, for a while, I didn't even do video guides for Abyssrium until people kept asking for them, just because I don't... <laughs> the whole reason I made my written guide is because there were only video guides for Abyssrium, and I hated having to watch videos. But I, I will keep doing video guides, but just... <laughs> Expect the highest quality and most concise information in the written guide because I can edit those. I can edit, edit the in the be, 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 be. as you can see. I can't edit videos as easily, but I can edit any new information into a written guide. Can't really do that with a video due to how YouTube works things. The only way to edit info into YouTube videos was annotation, and then they killed those. So that's cool. But yeah, the, some common problems people have with the, the events, uh, with the treasure map thing, is just not having all of the 
theme items equipped. As I said, always do that. Always, forever. All, all 100 years, Morty. All 100 years. Just always wear them until you have all the hidden fish. Oh, and a comment, uh, some people, like, this, they had apparently hadn't even played the game before this event and didn't know that, like, oh, um, you, you say how to get the golden seahorse, but I don't see it in my list. Uh, hidden fish, should have mentioned this earlier, but, like, hidden fish, they're hidden. You gotta do the unlock until they, before they appear. So that's why, that's why that works. I, I would recommend checking out my guide and, like, the beginner stuff before trying to do event stuff. Because, you know, events kind of work in a similar way to the main game as well. So hidden fish work like that. Also, I don't know if they ever actually fixed the crab bug, where, like, he digs and gives pearls, but he doesn't actually give pearls. They never... I don't think they ever fixed that. But whatever. Um, so yeah, I wouldn't really recommend trying to dig with the crab too much. I don't think it ever really worked. Also, it gives you these partial gems. Like, he'll give you one gem, but everything else gives you ten gems, and nothing costs one gem, so you just... I just have this four here forever. <laughs> I don't really like that, but whatever. Um, that's pretty much it. Just kind of a random info dump, but I had no other real way to cram all of this into one, or even just a couple videos. Just things to be aware of before the next event. Um, I'll have a video for the next event as soon as I can, as always. That's, that's why I always hoard the candy so I can do a video. I always find it kind of funny. If I do, if I wait even a day before doing a video, people are screaming that I need to do a video. And if I do a video on the first day, people are like, how did you, how do you do this so fast? How? Are you a wizard? And yes, I'm a wizard. So, that's about it. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you in the anniversary event.